Hello everyone, in today's video we're going to edit Canva templates in Microsoft Word. Now, we are continuing our video series where I am, ex or I should say we are exploring everything under the file tab. This is the file tab here in our ribbon menu. And if we come here, I'll also link the playlist to all the videos that I've done so far. So if you come here to File and uh, you click New, right now we're working on the New tab. I've done everything possibly under the Home tab. For those who have been following these videos, if I missed anything, I know that I did not do um, the Shared With Me tab and I'll possibly do that in the future. I'll think of something but uh, if we come here to the new tab uh, under the file menu you'll see this is where we have templates for Microsoft Word now I even tried searching online for cool templates just like what we would see in Canva to no avail unfortunately I'm not dissing Word or anything I'm just being truthful and realistic but what we can do is go to Canva and we could search for whatever it is that we want to search. So the first thing we're going to search for, let's do a resume, you know, that's really popular to search for. So let's go resume. Okay, so this is Canva Home. This is, I went to canva.com. You could do that on your own. And this is the home page. And on the home page, you'll see um, what will you design today. Let me just take this off. What will you design today? And I came here and I clicked resume and I could just click enter to search now there are a host of designs here that you could choose from some of them are free some of them you have to pay so let's just choose one that's free I'll go with this one brown mini, mini why can't I say that word brown minimalist <laughs> uh i don't really like resumes with photos um you could choose that if you want to let me just go with something that's really just basic so i'll use this one i'll click that and i'll click customize this template Now they're advertising something over here on the right hand side here. I don't want that. I'll just close that and I'll get right into the tutorial. Now I made a video previously about complications with, you know, importing a template from Canva into Word and then when you import it into Word you realize that fonts are either missing or objects are missing or shapes are missing. Now I'll link that video also so that you could um, deal with that, like you know what to do in that case and situation. But basically, if you don't have a uh, converter, firstly let me tell you what we're going to do. We're going to just share this and we're going to make it into a PDF document. Now, if your fonts in this document here in Canva are not available in Microsoft Word those fonts possibly will not go across it's going to look empty so the first thing I like to do is just change the font to something that Microsoft Word already has right for a future video I'm going to show you guys how to have um, how to overcome that that barrier but that's not this type of video so a popular font as I stated in the previous video here on the channel is that we could use a font that's common or popular in words so Arial is always a popular font or um, we have uh, Century Gothic Ugh, it goes on right I like Century Gothic or just Plain Times New Roman for uh, resumes you could do your own thing so what we're gonna do here we're just gonna click double click here in the empty space here we're gonna double click and hold and drag right 
and then we'll come up here where it says mul multiple fonts we're going to click there and we're going to choose times new roman and everything should change so let's zoom up into the document and see if everything changed and like a boss <laughs> everything changed all our fonts changed so now we're ready to take this over into microsoft word now at the top right hand corner here we click share and we'll click download and in the file type section here we'll click there and we click pdf standard that's what we need that's the type of pdf we need let's download that and then we will take it over now what i notice sometimes when you take it over into microsoft word on its own it still doesn't always come with everything that it was downloaded with so i like to go online and look for a, a word a pdf to word converter and that right now so we're going to go to google and we're going to type google.com now this video could apply to any type of image or template in canva it could be a flyer it could be a business card i just chose resume because i, I just wanted to right so now we click here i'm going to type i love pdf yeah that's actually a site it's right here at the top we click that and there are several options we have to choose from here now what we want is PDF to Word so we click there we will click select PDF file and when our open dialog box comes up we're gonna to go to downloads and it's the most recent file there we click open it shows itself here and then we're going to click convert to word then we download word right meaning the document and that will go into our download folder now if we come well this is chrome that i'm using the most updated chrome browser so if we come to the top here in the right hand corner and we click the download icon we'll see um, our microsoft word file that's ready to download or open it's, it's been downloaded already so now it's ready to be opened so we click that and we'll wait for it to open all right now we go to the top here where it says protective view in the yellow bar our strip and we click enable editing and now we will be able to edit now I'm just gonna change my name that's Johanna Benny now it dropped down into another line I guess my name was too long so let's dub double click and select we go up here to the home tab and then we'll go to the font size section click the down arrow and we'll choose a smaller size font now as we hover over the font sizes it will change along with wherever we go without um what would you call it it will change without changing if you know what i mean <laughs> okay um so let's click now we chose size 28 now it's smaller uh, we have account manager we'll not change that i'm gonna put my okay and not my real number but i'll leave that there i could put my email address so let's backspace and we'll put um rgc jamaica and with the address we'll see and everything else could stay let's just see i just <laughs> i'm too lazy to create a re resume for myself i'll just use this resume and i'll go to save at the top here in the left hand corner now it's saved automatically because the file is in the download folder 
you could always close this out and go into your download folder and move it to wherever you want it on your laptop or thumb drive wherever or your external but that's it that's how you edit canva templates in microsoft word <laughs> i hope this tutorial was useful to you uh do remember to subscribe to the channel and i have more awesome videos coming up you won't want to miss that if you're into microsoft word like i am subscribe and i'll see you in the next one bye bye now